Hello everyone, today I'm going to talk about very lunate dislocation imaging. Very lunate dislocation or very lunate fracture dislocation are often missed on initial imaging. This injury involves dislocation of the campus relative to the lunate which remain in normal arrangement with the disorders. They should not be confused with lunate dislocation where lunate is dislocated in polar direction and no longer has normal radio lunate articulation. Overall, kappa dislocation account for less than 10% of all recent century. Perilunate dislocation typically occur in young adults with high energy trauma resulting in the loading of the, of the hyper extended ulnary levated end. Around 60% of perilunate dislocation are associated with a skyphoid fracture, which is then termed transcyphoid perilunate dislocation. The other type are perilunate transradial styloid and transcyphoid transcapitated periluna. Typical story is of all of the four on to a dorsiflexaris. There may or may not be obvious clinical deformity. Occasionally, major nerve injury arterial compromise or compartment symptoms may be evident due to the dislocation. Perilunate dislocation involves traumatic rupture of the radius scaffold capitate scaffold lunate interosseous and lunate lunar trichetral interosseous ligament. My field AL have Propose a four stage of process to describe perilunar risk instability, where perilunate dislocation represents stage two. PA radiograph. So in EP radiograph, dislocation is often often overlooked. This graph was normal smooth line made by tracing the proximal articular surface of the Hamata and capitate. Increase overlap of lunate and capitate. Piece of high signs. Uh, Signet ring sign. So this same uh, the in 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 the this uh, same uh, the arrow indicates the sequence of trauma injury in progressive perilunate instability. In lateral radiograph, dislocation more easily appreciable. Capitate not sitting within the distal articular cup of the lunate. Line draw through radius and ulna fail to intersect capitate. Lunate uh, remain in articulation with distal radius. Abnormal scaffold lunate angle. Abnormal capitate lunate angle. So this is the same man.